In an attempt to criticize the media for calling the 2020 presidential election for Joe Biden and to show they've made mistakes in the past, multiple Trump campaign staffers Sunday tweeted a picture of the front page of a post-election edition of the Washington Times from 2000 that declared Al Gore president, the only problem was, the image was fake. Greeting staff at a Team Trump HQ this morning, a reminder that the media doesn't select the president, Murtaugh said in the now-deleted tweet linking to the doctored image. It's highly unlikely any of the potential recounts or Trump campaign lawsuits will reverse the projected outcome of the 2020 election. Recounts rarely reverse the result of an election, and Biden currently leads by at least 20,000 votes in three battleground states, Pennsylvania, Wisconsin and Michigan, that allowed him to clinch the Electoral College. He could run up his total margin in the Electoral College even further with a victory in Georgia, a state he is currently leading in that has yet to be called. Experts say the flurry of lawsuits the Trump campaign has filed since Election Day are unlikely to change the outcome either, as some have already been dismissed in court while others are not expected to come close to making up Biden's margin of victory across several battleground states. We're heading for some recounts. Don't expect them to change the outcome. Forbes